Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and um, in the next several videos, we'll be looking at some of the changes, some of the things that have been added to Windows 11, or that will be added soon, as we'll go through 25H2, and hopefully, um, maybe you like them, maybe these changes are nice, I find that there are some improvements that have been arriving to uh, Windows 11, but yeah, of course, still a work in progress as, you know, it's a Windows as a service. Always remember that this means it's always constantly being tweaked. And uh, one of them is in the settings. When you go to the settings app, uh, one of the things that I do find really nice is that in the system tab and at the about page, they have... Um, done this panel at the top here, which is really nice. This about page now has these little uh, cards at the top, one that gives you the storage, how much space you uh, have for storage, the um, amount of graphics card memory, the amount of installed RAM, and of course the processor that you use, uh, which is pretty nice. I think it's a quick way to see all the information on the uh, about page quickly and also at the same time while you get all the device specifications uh, and the windows specifications with what version number you are at and so on so i think this is nice i think this is an improvement because before this about page was just straightforward text not a lot of people wanted to go read anything on this page before uh, and, you know, it wasn't that clear, not as clear as it is now, uh, as it is now to uh, have the information. So I think this was a good idea in the modifications of the About page to make all of this clearer and that it's faster for everyone to have the basic uh, device information. If somebody asks you, you know, how much RAM you got um, and uh, how much space you have or, or how big your hard drive is and so on. It's all visible here, and uh, it's easy to just, oh, this is what I got as a uh, processor, as, you know, the, the RAM, my graphics card uh, memory, or is it shared memory or not, and the storage. Um, to note that the graphics card memory that is here is the dedicated memory that the card has itself, so that's important to understand. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.